Hello everybody, this is Toys R Us and for this bonus quick news update video I've once again found something on the internet that I just wanted to share with you. So right now going on, very lucky people, especially in LA, are experiencing TFCon. Now we've had loads and loads of third party reveals, so I'm going to try and get as many of them across to you as I can in a couple of little videos. The reason why it's going to be a couple of videos is because there's just so much. This particular video I'm going to focus on uh, mainly the legend scale figures and indeed the smaller ones as well. So even smaller than legend scales, haven't got Doctor to we yet but we've got some things called nanobots and i'm gonna just go straight into this and show you right now so yeah this obviously event started on friday it seems to be huge it's all over social media everybody's talking about it and i've previewed these to you before now we've actually got some great tests or prototypes should we say of these now what i like about these is they look a little bit like dr Wu, but they're much much smaller um you can see you've got the height there so 24 millimeters in height uh, the only thing that's i suppose a little negative about this is they don't actually transform all these images if you want them better as i say are off tfw 2005 there indeed is their take on shockwave who they are calling parsons <laughs> um and that's an obvious prototype there so no color on him but to give you an idea of his scale and just how small he is now there's two versions of Grimlock because they don't transform they've got the T-Rex mode and the robot mode there's the robot mode standing right next to of course the Titan arc so this is what these are going to be really good for to be displayed uh, to scale with them that looks like cliff jumper on masterpiece uh, Skyfire and there we've got an actual you know to show you how small they are just a regular household double a and triple a battery these things are tiny you can see the ball and socket joints though in their elbows etc in the back of their legs there is their take on hound and there indeed is grimlock again but you can see in robot mode next to jazz so what's really interesting about this is although they're tiny though they don't transform they scale the same as what they did in the cartoon so again for your displays for working with your titans they're going to look amazing there's reflector obviously megatron's a bit bigger and indeed there is the grimlock in the t-rex mode just a bit further behind as well um, and there's again a lovely little display oh no that's not them of them as well so these of course as i said are nanobots and it looks like they are really cracking on with getting them done. Right, moving on, Magic Square. A couple of things I'm just going to gloss over because we've seen already. Um, Magic Square, we've seen Blueberry Girl a couple of times. This is their, it's sort of like a Chibu style, which is the oversized head. Um, their take on Chromia, which is stunning because this is fully transformable. She looks amazing. She's fully poseable. And as I said, I've, I've discussed and showcased loads of photos of her on this channel already because she's just she looks so clever and then the next thing's coming up as well we've seen little bits of but there's new images so yeah magic square started to tease us with their take on bruticus i think it was a month or so ago maybe two months we of course saw um all these images they were teased one day at a time so there's their take on brawl swindle blast off vortex and indeed onslaught then we got a couple of images which we, again we've seen so there's the fully combined mode and of course there's brawl in colors we then managed, or we were lucky enough to see a test piece or prototype of Brawl, but this is a new image. We've not seen this yet. So there's a full colour, looks to be prototype of Brawl. So really, really starting to stoke, as I say, and build a hype train with these because they look really good, don't they? So there is Brawl. Then we've had this image very, very recently. This is their take on the Dinobot slug or the other way, depending on what you refer to him as. There he is in the alternate mode. Again, legend scale figures. These guys look spectacular. Um, I'm going to come back to that later on because that's not legend scale, that's masterpiece size. And then I'm going to move very quickly on just for this video to the other um, excellent company for making legend scales. That is, of course, New Age. So we've got Hughes. That's why I couldn't read it backwards. We've got Hughes, which is their take on Power Glide. And of course, because they're going to use the mold there, of course, oh, it's the GoBot, isn't it? Names just completely forgot me. And then, of course, this deco was used in Combiner Wars um, as well. So, again, funnily enough, I couldn't remember the name, but I've just seen, there we go, the actual figure right next to me. So I love it when they do these. It's just brilliant for all the collectors who want all the different colours. There is H54 Frankenstein, which, if you remember, was Autobot Spike. But you can see, look, it's going to be um, a Combiner as well, which is brilliant then we've got but I'm, i call these balling and um dwarling but of course they're not it'll be bailing and dwarling i think but this is new ages take on huffer and pipes no actual in-hand physical images just computer concept and of course we've got their take on wind charger as well and instead of doing the triceratops they've gone and done sludge 
with a great name as well. Let me see if I can pronounce this. Rhodosaurus, I think it is. So this is mainly, there is Iron Factory as well. I'm going to come back with a video on Iron Factory a bit later on. I want to do these in little small snippets because, again, there's too much to ingest and get it all in. If you want to see these images and know a little bit more, TFW 2005 and T Formers as well. But in the meantime, I'll be back to you soon with some more noise. News, take care.